Just more or less fresh. <laughs> what about Guyabano? No Guyabano, only the weekends I guess. Yeah. Christmas moods all around. Bongo's gonna go for the grill. Yeah. Oh. Well, as you see, the Christmas is everywhere. Christmas songs, themes, and I guess this is gonna be the huge market. All this place is gonna be turned to the, the market, Christmas market. Same as we have back in Europe. <laughs> cc yeah very practical stuff you, you, you have a motorbike on it yeah my bike is uh, around the corner <laughs> yeah this one is good yeah this one yeah it's a brand new ah not a few years i bought in manila so i keep it here all the time so wherever i come back i always have my bike with me so that's good you know but i bought in manila and, uh, and i took it from manila with the ship to cebu and from Cebu I was uh, traveling to Negros and from Negros to Sikihor by boat and from Sikihor to take Bilaran here to Bohol. Uh, already already go to the Tawala. Tawala, yeah. Aluna. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. It's a nice place. Yeah, too much tourists. Yeah, too much tourists. <laughs> too touristy. I like more nature and uh, natural stuff. Touristy stuff is boring, yeah. I guess. Yeah, Finnish market for the day. Evening most you see it's like around maybe eight o'clock in the evening and everybody already go home. So the streets here get empty very fast, very soon. Looks like a little bit undermanaged. Erosion, a little bit dirty. Yeah. But the beach by itself, yeah, it's a beautiful one. You see the trees are nearly falling in. See the erosion. Well, it's not the best time to look on the things like that at night. Like, you know, the night keep a critical view on the beach.
small fish over there. Tiny ones. So low tide, haven't seen before so low. Well, yeah, I guess I need to learn that this uh, schedule of the tides. Very brave color scheme. This uh, green, blue, red. I guess they go for uh, very brave color schemes because the density is so so little now. Once the density will be increased, so those buildings gonna look and stand out, and uh, they will gonna go for more peaceful colors. I guess in future. So it's like that. We call it a gypsy style. If it's too much, kind of overdose with the color and maybe different kind of decoration specifically if this decoration is just you no know, piece of the plastic styrofoam makes the like Greek columns or something like that so well you see already kind of more temperate more practical color well, it's always the development and also architecture by itself is a it's a piece of art you you can't make art without experience the more you see around you see this one green also so many details the steel and then uh, tiles and everything well it's it's come so time you know people develop the taste with the food, with the art, with everything, the more you taste the things in, uh, in around you in this life, the more you have understanding of what's good, what's bad, what's oversaturated. So you develop your taste with the time. Well, this is a market and, uh, and a mall. Yeah, in one package. commercial building ICM Iceland City Mall Market and also bus station. And that's a future uh, biggest spot for everything. Uh, the 
rough on edges as always but the markets if you're gonna go around the world they are more or less the same you know you can't expect from the market kind of clean pristine environment it's always gonna look a little bit rough on edges farmers come with the trucks fresh produce this is my favorite place, that one inside. Always fresh veggies and such things. So yeah. Just love it. As for the looks, it could be better. As for the quality, yeah, it's good as it could be. Here's my Guabana lady. Yeah. This you can get, you know, the most, the most of out of the uh, freshest and cleanest foods. You talk with locals, and they're gonna suggest you. And maybe you will be able to find also eco products, organic ones. time when I come in the market I feel like energy you see those beautiful trees. fish veggies fruits what could be better it's very difficult to even imagine what could be better and uh, after market they're gonna go for the for the mall and what kind of feelings you have when you go in the mall yeah boring boring stuff Well, it's, it's like that, it's always, it looks very funny and interesting, it's rough on edges, but it provides you some, some certain value. As for the market, it provides you, I guess, very good, very quality value products. Very difficult to get natural things in industrial way. Very difficult. Possible, but I guess for the Philippines, for the purchasing power, which is not the greatest here, it's very difficult. So you can't expect like uh, eco products as we have in back in Europe, in big sections, big aisles, in uh, shopping malls. Oh, they are there. You can find some, but it's yeah, it's not uh, as convenient as uh, as. Uh, big choice as you are gonna get on the market so for that reason the market is number one choice check the bags check the veggies good morning nothing sir. nothing thank valuable you. inside thank you <laughs> I'm gonna go to the second floor. I'm gonna go for the second floor. We're uh, meeting uh, uh, the globe, so we're gonna check uh, all the options which is here for the internet. As for uh, as us, again, foreigners, when you are distant from the home, you would like to probably have a you know, good connection, either for uh, communication with your family, work or whatever, either for the work in general. So for that reason, you need to have a good connection, which could be sometimes issue still. 
and, uh, and a little bit pricey also. You may think that's normal, it should be expensive. I will say no. In developed economies, in Europe, the internet is like a must, it's not an option. So we have, I have at home 100 megabytes and this uh, 100 Mbps cost me 15 euros to 10 euros. So exchange, well, it's good. This place exchange really well. So <clears throat> there's nothing special about that. It's just you know, a matter of uh, a matter of uh, technology penetration and investment. So if the people have a decent investment in, uh, in technology equipment, <coughs> which is uh, widely available, you can get it anywhere. You can buy it either Europe, United States or China, wherever. So you just need to put infrastructure in place. Have agreements with the landowners, put the towers, more towers, more coverage, better speed. And that's it, you have it. So they try to do that. And there's two companies who provide internet here in the Philippines. It's a, one is called Smart, another one is called Globe. So we're gonna visit the Globe today, see what they can provide. You can see from the web page all the, all the options, but uh, I would like to talk with them and ask uh, questions like, for example, they, they, they offer uh, up to, like up to 5 Mbps, up to 10, 15, 20 Mbps. So, we have it also in Europe, up to, but it's going to be very close. If it's up to 5, it's going to be 4.5. So I want to sure, I want to be sure if it's going to be here uh, the same way. If they say it's up to 10, then it's going to be maybe 9. It's not going to be 5. So that's a question. That's not the issue, it's just a question. What else? Amounts gigabytes per month unlimited there are options like this for example you see 1699 up to 5 megabytes now it's 10 we're gonna see if it's like this one installation fee ask us and the next step is like nearly 2,000 pesos, 1899, where you have uh, up to 10 or 20. So the globe is definitely the leader here in the, in the mobile internet. Fast mobile home internet. Oh yeah. So we're gonna meet my neighbor and we're gonna go inside because she have already a uh, contract on her name. How the foreigners are able to get those uh, offers. Uh, some, are, some of them are prepaid, so you pay in front and you get it. Some are on a uh, 24 months contract. So with this one, I guess you need to have a local one, owner of the apartments which you rent, so you can have agreement with them. They're willing to provide you the service. We have a better speed, more gigabytes. If you have this contract, as always, commitment can kind of yield you back something if you commit for something. Yeah, we see we have a connection from the globe with home already. Ah, you have a lady? Yeah. My landlord, she had, had it in Viking. So we used up this 150 gigabytes for this month. Uh, yeah. She have uh, up to 5 Mbps, 150 gigabytes. And now we're thinking we should switch to the unlimited one. Uh, for that one, sir, we don't have uh, unlimited for the wireless. Only for 150 gig. Lang. But I saw you have the different kind of offers on your web page. And there's a 1699 5 uh, Mbps unlimited. The 1699 is not available for wire wireless because uh, your area is wireless. Uh huh. Wireless speaking is only, wireless. Yeah, only for 129 offer, but uh, 150 gig only mm -hmm. every month. 
So all those offers which you have on the web page, they are just in certain areas, like this unlimited is going to be only uh, Tagbilaran. Tagbilaran and then Publishon Dawis. Publishon Dawis. Publishon Dawis. Publishon Dawis and then the Big King is a uh, publishon from Dawis. So it's but different. The, but yeah. the Big King is only for wireless. Speaking exactly, so only for wireless, yeah. Uh -huh. For the population that was, is, uh, we have a line, we have a cable connection. And then Cecilia, come over us. So she is owner of the house. We were talking, we just begin the discussion. And he told us that he's in, he's in publication. Yes. Yes. We can go in English so I can understand also. Guys, please in English so I understand also, uh, so we know that. You can ask the unlimited connection yeah. in your area, but we don't have offer in uh, speaking now is it because your area is uh, only wireless. Okay. Just use wireless there, so there's no unlimited. So you know this address, you, uh, uh, yeah. Tarsi, you can give the precise address in Beking. It's, it's yeah, double. It's, it's Beking those Dawis. Beking those. Mm -hmm. So no yeah. way, it's yeah. only wireless. It's it because it's uh, from Dawis. Okay, you uh, know this area now very well. Okay, so what is the solution? We used up this 150 uh, gigabytes this month. We have a... Uh, one number. Uh, it's up, it's up. Okay, yeah. We have a uh, 100 gig for additional to your monthly 499. So, so from my, my 100 gig plus 250, uh, 150 is total of 250. 250 gig, gig is yeah. gonna be 499 pesos. Yeah, additional, more, yeah. additional, yeah. So for from my current 129 from, from my present 1299 150 gig 150 gig plus 100 gig. 100 Yeah, there's a price here. 150, 600, 200, 800, mm. and 1,000 for 300. No questions, but I guess we're gonna clear out more or less all of them. We're early in the morning. You see the queue is not so big. So we will be able to understand what is on offer. Is. But it's already good news. We have uh, options for the boost. So we can buy additional gigabytes and uh, 100 gigabytes is going to cost you 500 around. So which is, I guess, it's decent offer. It's nothing uh, to shy away. 100 gigabytes it's, uh, could, be, could be enough for us. But of course, uh, unlimited, uh, that's what we need. And uh, if we're three people using the one internet connection, it's going to be a little bit too short for us, all of us. See, like this good offer, 100 Mbps, 3000. I pay for 100 Mbps back in Europe, around uh, 700, maybe 800 pesos. So you see our development network is so far away. And, uh, it's growing, it's getting faster. Like each year I come in the Philippines and I see they getting a little bit faster and uh, more gigabytes. So we're gonna check the address. Alu, 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 that's my neighbor. And high speaking elementary school. So we're gonna figure out where we are located, which is the closest tower, and which is what is available uh, in this area. Uh, we'll see. We're gonna see. Fingers crossed. Researching the things and the thing is like that. That uh, the tower where we are connected is too far away from the house. So uh, polygon, as they call it. So we're far away and we can't have a uh, unlimited connection. So the only boost which we are able to get and this boost. Me, uh. Yes, okay, okay. Boost is a little bit expensive. It's like 150 gigabytes additional 599. Yeah. We're gonna get application so we can follow usage and also buy additional loads, which is convenient. A little bit pricey, but convenient. 
can I switch to the globe? Do you have some benefits uh, if I'm switching from the smart to the globe? No. Can I keep my number? If you know. Also no. In Europe, you can keep your number for uh, any. Actually, here in the Philippines, also. Um, the president is uh, uh, the president wants Order, to yeah. Yeah, ordering like that, but it's not yet um, the law. Okay. But maybe the next year, we don't know okay. yet. Okay, cool. I see the improvements like each year, they're getting better. That's for mm -hmm. sure. People working so that's okay. The Hi, good morning. <coughs> so we're gonna ask our questions about usage and speed, yeah. What we do now we're discussing the with the they call express assistance uh, all the questions how we used our uh, amount of the gigabytes which were provided is it the upload and uh, upload and download counts together how much we already used from this 150 gigabytes so once I know this data so I can make my decision this for now it's look like it's a little bit pricey it's, everything is available like a uh, slowest speed which they can provide on the island is around uh, three to four mbps uh, which they offer as up to five and then if you are lucky in your better uh, better location you can get up to 10 mbps and also uh, you have a better boost volume amounts which you can buy like for 500 gigabytes for 600 pesos which is decent unfortunately we are in a location where is uh, really a little bit in jungle so <laughs> we are only on a wireless as they call connection so here we have uh, 150 gigabytes for 600 pesos and 300 gigabytes for 1000 pesos speed speed around three to four yeah, if you're lucky not gonna have five but that's enough if you are just a lot of general information internet and some videos all the time so i ask the questions i'm waiting for replay uh, and then it looks like i have covered all the questions so now i just need to make my decision what we're gonna do with this boost would we buy one I need to find some other place where I can upload files in high speed. Like co-working places, maybe uh, and look around the city. So if you work with the files, uh, with big files, more than 50 gigabytes a day, so you need some kind of uh, solution. If you work maybe with 5 gigabytes in a day, then you're going to be 150 gigabytes in a month, so you're going to be able to manage all these connections. I'm nearly done, I'm like, just waiting for you to check on the usage, how much is already used and what kind of data is used, either upload, either download. Well, half of the day, figure out the questions, but uh, as for now, what we understand, we can have only a limited connection because of the, our location, but if you're lucky, you can have this connection. Well, we're done. We're done for the moment. Nothing, no good news, no even bad news. This is what it is. You need to pay. You want a little bit more data? You pay. pay. Yes, money, money, and money. The, as and the loyalty is no. No, no loyalty. Not yet? <laughs> no loyalty discount. Not yet. Not loyalty, yeah. Let's yeah, see. That's the light. We're looking for the, our neighbor. At the same time, I'm gonna go and, and get some water for me. Big bottle. So my neighbors come with the car, so it's convenient for me to put uh, my big bottle of water in the car. Because I, I travel with my, my bikey. Ooh, yeah, hectic day, you see, spend all day to look around uh, internet. And options. But this is kind of sweet spot. Go look for the bikes. Bikies. This is for the bikes. Uh, 67, 98. It's priceless. Also a priceless. So I guess they remove the prices in order to give you discounts and so on. So you're not confused with it. 
pressing the bike. On the 34. Three, two, nine. So heavy. Ah, I see. The bike is good, but it's so heavy. It's very heavy in uh, seating position. Yeah, well, I guess that uh, just for the average driving around is uh, automatic is good thing, you know, like this. Yeah, is one of the good choices. Suzuki Rider Suzuki Rider No Rider yeah. Well it's still sporty yeah. The position is a little bit more kind of lean down Mio is my, my favorite of course. Mio. Mio, yeah, so comfy. Yeah, all the way. All the way, just automatic. Why should you kind of uh, expose yourself to more obstacles and difficulties? Why? Upon the click. I was drawing on the click in Bali. I like it a lot. Yeah, Honda Click I guess is the best choice for the small bikes, 125cc, Honda Click, very good one, uh, decent space in the back, but also you have uh, options to put the racks here, put a good rack in the back. This looks very comfy also. This is like, like mine. Well, this is very comfy. It's half automatic. It's very comfy. Very good one. Half automatic. Yamaha side. 60,000. Yeah, the bikes is in modern times. It's just like a machines for uh, anything. You see sometimes, you know, the people commuting uh, like four or five on one bike. Powerful, easy to maintain. Uh, all the way till this day, it was long lasting, unstoppable. So, such a useful thing. You see, it's very little or no box in the back, that's the thing. As for this one, you have more, more space in the back. The click is uh, in uh, like this one 76, very good price. It's 98, 98. And the difference, I guess, in, is in options. Maybe also in the size of the engine. I'm not sure. It stands here. No, I don't see it. Oh, it's 150. Yeah, this is the size of the engine, 125. So, I guess this one is the best option. 76,000, 25. Some small box over there. Look for the helmet for this. Your small belongings. Yeah. 
beautiful color for this one. back someday to check them more more thoroughly because, yeah you need to dive in the details so you can choose the thing which you want which suits you most well I guess I'm done with the moss Biggest fan, or I can't spend so much time in boss anymore. Don't feel like um, any any value in that. Seduction all the way around. See the cakes, fast food. Nothing for me. So I get uh, I get get my water. So now we're gonna go back to the market, see some Guiabano, and then explore the place where you can get fast internet in the city. Yeah. Happy family! <laughs> there was one place where you can have a fast internet here. Check is that true? So this was what's uh, coffee? This way, yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Well, you see, it's not a preferable way to, to deal with stuff, but if you can't have a fast internet at home, what are you going to do? You need to find a public place where you can uh, come over and uh, get your computers with you and upload all the stuff that you need to upload. For the basic needs, I guess, uh, it's going to be sufficient uh, at home. But we're uploading uh, gigabytes and gigabytes. That could be challenging. Like a typical uh, one day, yeah, if I'm just walking around, don't do uh, crazy edits, it's gonna be around 50, 60 sometimes. Yeah, like last few days was around 100 gigabytes, 105, 98. Well, yeah, yeah, boss coffee, I'm gonna check. Well, I don't want to sit in, uh, in uh, some cafeteria and uh, be working on my files. But specifically, there is a uh, very big file, so it's going to take upload maybe a few hours. Oh, oh it's coffee. Well, let's check. The place looks cozy. Do we have Wi Fi here? Sorry, sir. Our Wi Fi is down. No it's internet. down, no internet, yeah. It's just today or. One week already, yeah. Uh -huh. Because I heard from uh, Glow people, they told me that you can come over here, have a good coffee, and uh, have a good internet. Do you know when you're gonna have it back? Uh, maybe when the 
technician come here, sir. They always ask that. Uh, they will send here. Okay. Uh, what was the speed before? Speed before was 3,400. Speed before BPS. 3,400, yeah. Do, do you know this, uh, some place where you can have like high speed, like 100 Mbps or maybe 50 in a mall here? Uh, try, try on farms or on the malls or in the city. Maybe you know some place in the city where it's very high speed internet. We have uh, the, uh, the second branch near Cathedral, the Bosco Field, so sir. We have high internet. How, how, how fast is internet there? Uh, ELDT. ELDT? How fast this could be? Not sure. Something like 5 to 10, it's nothing crazy, not 50, not 100, no such speeds, yeah? No, no such speeds. You see, I see from your face, you're just wondering. There's no wonder I have in Europe back at home 100. And if you go in the city, you have maybe 200, 300. So for us, 2-3 two, two, is like, you know, I don't remember, maybe 15 years ago, not now. So we have in the hundreds. But okay, so no options, you don't know exactly, yeah? So I need to research for myself here. Well, thank you. But I see a nice smell from the coffee here. I guess the cafeteria is a very good one. Thank you. Okay, next time. See you. Thank you. Mmm, looks beautiful. It smells beautiful. Seducting. Tempting. And patience. Well, brown. Farm. Let me see. So why are so many people here? Do you have some special offer? Uh, yeah, we have freebies here. Uh, freebies? Yeah. Okay. Many freebies. What kind of freebies you have? Some offer. We have a uh, headset, large charger, case, expensive That's why we have a lot of customers here. Oh, nice. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It's good. You see, you have a... Uh, Christmas presents all around. If you buy some, you get some. Christmas promo also here. Food work. Food every day. Let's go and check uh, internet connection there. Maybe I'm gonna have a lucky spot where I can upload my terabytes of uh, videos. gonna get fat you know, if I'm gonna go here and uh, spend my time here each day definitely can get fat well there was 81 megabytes Upload. Ooh, we have beautiful views also. Wow, that's a decent place. Spend time. Oh, this. Hello. What we have here? 72. Upload. 3.9. Download. Looks great. <laughs> So we probably have found my place. What well, you need to have, you need to have a jacket. Goes into the sea. As for my taste, it's a little bit too cold. Salamat. Driver mm. license in New York. I'm gonna visit this place a little bit later. I'm not a little bit in the mood to get discussions about my driver license. I can use my driver license here for three months. So three months I have a, uh, I have an option to use my European driver license. 
and then I need to renew it or need to figure out what I'm gonna do with this. So I'm looking for the, for the plug. Can I plug somewhere? Sorry, maybe you have a plug to charge up the phone? No plugs available, yeah? Looks available. The good news. You see the ammo speed here. Looks good. I wouldn't say something. Uh, something crazy. Spectacular, but pleasant view. Look, this one. Crappy. Yeah, we're disappointed with the with the fact that I can't have a unlimited internet at all. And I need to look for the other options. Which is such a waste of the time. You need to go out. You need to look for the options. You're not going to be able to do that at home. Right. 21. Wow, this one is a good one. 21 to 60. You see, if you get in an island like this, you may want, but you will not get what you want. And you uh, may be ready to pay for that, but you're still not going to be able to get it. Oh, this is a very popular place.
looking for the blender. I still don't have my blender. Towels. Yes, sir. Hello, hello, hello. Do you sell also the home appliances like a blender? Blender? Over there, sir. Clients. Clients. Okay, thank you, thank you. Check the blenders. Actually, you don't need bigger one than this. Like you make uh, for each meal, fresh one. And this one. Oh well. Sorry. Hello, guys. Like this one. This have also the cup, big one. Ah, this one is that one, yeah, okay. I want a small one, but uh, with the one liter cap, or maybe 500 grams cap. This is the smallest one, yeah? This one is the smallest that you have, yeah? Mm. Something same, but uh, with a cone cap, no? Okay, I'm gonna research. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So I'm gonna see around what we have. Oh, that one is a good one, yeah. This is cone shape. Candy wood. Blend track. And you have uh, options. Yeah, well, this is a good one. It's beauty. Well, the Ford typically makes very robust, simple, practical cars. It is what it is. 2.2 mm, Yeah We were discussing the internet connection in Philippines and, and of course it's always like that You're a foreigner, you're hypocritical and uh, local people may think you know you're arrogant Arrogant or uh, uh, high-minded, but I will say so You see we just live in different worlds we're a little bit more advanced and uh, don't take us hard. We, we wish the best for the Philippines and we, of course we enjoy the place. But at the same time we need to be clear-minded. And if there is obstacles or uh, problems, you need to mention them. So people know that you are talking some uh, uh, real experiences. You don't make the rose glass picture. So an expectation, expectations should be kind of explained. You come over here and you think you're going to be able to connect 100 megabytes. The internet as we do back in, in Europe for a uh, thousand pesos, it's may not going to happen. You may get it in some certain areas for two or three times more expensive. You will be able to get it. Don't get me wrong. It's not like you sometimes people say it's third world country. I guess it's, it sounds very really bad. It's very wrong to call it like this, definitely not. Third world country is developing economy. 
but at the same time you meet some small difficulties which you need to figure out how you can uh, go around them and of course we enjoy this place we like this place so be patient and, uh, and be patient while you enjoy this beautiful place well you see this kind of options you can have here if you buy the stuff you can ask to help you transport them bring it to your car thank you thank you so good day good day good day how is business it's good <laughs> hopefully hopefully it's good oh, it's a little bit of that. Ooh, that's challenging wow hello 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 i need to dive in good. hello Okay, you're gonna go out. Ooh. Oh, well, again. Oof, the mall was cold. No, don't like the walls. Don't like AC, don't like the walls. Hello! Hello! Coca-Cola! Well, I'm back to my favorite place. Which is? Yes. Yeah, well, that's, that's an orgy down. Uh, I like the smell the dry fish. It smells good. Mm. But this fish is very good, you know, it's uh, kind of a uh, quality, it smells pleasant. Something like bad smell. Hello guys, how much is we about now? 50. The thing is that uh, I'm not an expert in Guiabano, I don't understand, you know, but sometimes they stay hard for a long time. And I don't know exactly what I need to do in order to get them uh, in the uh, right condition. Hello, hello, yeah, peanuts. Peanuts, I need to buy the peanuts also. Hello. Hello. Well, well, well. I may buy some of them. I'm not gonna be, buy maybe a big load of them. But I may buy some of them so I have with me some kilo or two, I guess. Hello. Kilo or two. The pumpkins. Ooh, see. Hello. See the Gubano. You see, the, I met one problem. Uh, I bought the Guyabanos. Uh, half of them was ripened and everything is okay, and half of them stay hard. Uh, I don't remember. But you know, half of them was hard and they get, get black inside. You never know. How you can tell if this guyabano get ripened? You buy only already ripe. Already ripe. That's the only only solution, yeah. Like this one, you already feel it's getting 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 soft, yeah. So then you buy them. It's very difficult to say. Sometimes they are like a stone, so that's mean they're not gonna get the ripen, yeah. Thank you, Farina. Yeah, we like guyabanos. It's healthy because if you eat too much papaya. Or banana. Too much sugar. Too much sugar. He has not so many. Not much sugar. This one is medicine. Medicine, exactly. Yeah. Like I saw in a shopping mall, Guyabano, uh, cancer killer, natural. Well, that's good food. Yeah. Easy to plant. Easy to plant. Yeah. Easy to grow. I'll grow the seeds. Grow the seeds. 
Well, it's, it's always work. You need to follow the things and so on. What about fertilizer? Do you use any fertilizer no. for them? No, no nothing. there's no fertilizer. No fertilizer yes. for them, yeah. That's a blessing. You see, there is no fertilizer, so if people have a chance to use them, they're gonna use them. Because the land and farming is very fertile. Mm -hmm. Fertile land and Carmen. Have you been to Carmen? Yeah, I've been to Carmen, Alicia, uh, Anda. I was I'm traveling motorbike all around. Uh, Beautiful mountains. Beautiful. I like Alicia mountains. It's even better than the chocolate hills. Yes. And you but can climb, you? climb up them. Oceania, there's many rubber in the street. Rubber in the street? Never met nobody. Yeah. No, I guess it's more or less peaceful. If you don't go crazy with your wallet like this, you will be safe. And uh, the precaution should be in a place, in any place, in the United States or Europe, you need to be cautious. Especially there in this market, uh, my that one, they, they are selling also there, yeah. their neighbor. Neighbor is bad. Yeah. That's why I don't, uh, I hold my son, do not go there. Anang Orex, buy tea. Well, yeah, yeah, well, yeah, all it is, it is. Some... I tell my son, do not go there. Which uh, place exactly? Carmen. Yeah. <coughs> but I was traveling all around there with a the motorbike. Uh... I'm living in Fatima Hill. Fati... Fatima? Fatima? There's a statue above. Fatima Hill, I'm leaving there. Okay, I can tell you where I have been, I can, oh. I can show you. That's my phone. Hagna. Hagna, yeah? Yes. Yeah, okay. Fatima Hill. Yeah. Hagna, Anda, Alicia. Uh, I have been all the way here and I have been also in Trinidad. Oh, you, you pass in Trinidad. Yeah, if you were yeah. in Trinidad, you pass in yeah, Fatima because, Hill. Yeah, because this is a beautiful area here. Yes. Many, many beautiful mountains here. Yes. So I was traveling from Anda all the way to Trinidad, back to uh, Chocolate Hills, and then uh, something like this, and then back to Panglao. I haven't been uh, only this side, here. I have been here, all around here, all around here, on the coast Panglao. This is my last place which I need to visit. They have been but also... here you pass that, but do not let yourself night. No night? night. Yeah. Well, we listened uh, advices. Yeah, we're gonna listen to the advices. I and this bad person need to eat also that's a problem when you when you have a bad person around you you need to understand that they don't work and they're not gonna do they're not gonna be doing that tomorrow because they used to steal and do the bad things so they're gonna continue do like that so either society isolate them Either you need to kind of count and uh, you have a dogs and protection and so on. That's a life. Oh, it's okay, I'm gonna walk with it. I'm gonna walk, all right? It's my toy now, today. Thank you. So I get this one. See, this is a present in the market. And uh, I'm gonna see there are some, some, some Guyabano offers here. And because I have just one backpack with me, I don't wanna be cluttering my backpack with the many things here around today. But definitely, I want to buy a little bit of Guayabana for me. Let's check this one. Sometimes they get right and sometimes they don't. This one, alu alu alu. Banana papaya. Banana papaya. I know that you have a nice. Uh, you have nice. Uh, 
how you call them? I forget. Pomelo. Them. Pomelo, exactly. Pomelo, yeah. Give me, just take me a video. How much is your pomelo? Fifty per kilo. Kilo, yeah. Okay, we're gonna take some. This one or? We're gonna take two of them, yeah, two. Give me the. Fifty one, fifty only. Well, thank for that. Thank yeah, you. thank you. Well, I have a. I get some. Uh, I get some. Uh, Pomelo. I get my my fruits, my guiabano, heavy bag. Oh, you see the beautiful mangoes. How much is this one? 300, yeah? 300 for the shrimps. I'm gonna think a little bit, thank you. 300 is a good price. I may take it some. Yes, sir. I'm looking, looking. How much is your fish today? You have beautiful, beautiful tuna. Yeah. And some tuna like you. So I'm just walking. How much is gonna be? Tuna? Yeah. All meat 380. 380, yeah. Yeah, without head. With head, 300. Sinabut mana kay? European So yeah, you see they're discussing. I understand guys, I speak in you know, all the languages. So no secrets. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, I'm gonna look around. I'm not sure about should I buy the fish today. Yesterday I have a huge bango, so uh, you don't want you don't want to overeat. That's for sure. Kamatis are tomatoes. The city reality.
traveler scene. Room rates from 350. It's rainy. rainy huh? Yeah, it's good. Good to have it. Here we have here this uh, Luisa. Luisa Gallery. Yeah. yeah check this place. Oh, that's the reality of the city. Issues with the parking here and motorbike. This is the one that goes to park the way. It's very kind of interesting. Customers are encouraged to bring their own echo bag, paper bag. Beautiful, beautiful initiative. It should be like this. Less plastic is better. Wait. You see the. Are you guys having some architecture? So so many. Oh, let me see. Source away. Small kitchen. kitchen is small. kitchen maybe can talk a little bit we can discuss the stuff so this is a source of way yeah can you give me some information about working hours regulations which you have here here in source of way yeah uh, in source of way uh, in one day uh, 250 in one day and they have a monthly membership 350 in a month the month Yes. Ah, 3,500 in yes. a month. Yeah. And we use pantry, they have free coffee. Mm -hmm. And they use this kitchen here. Mm -hmm. So, so we, have, we have a fast internet con connection. Uh, we have a 500 Mbps. Can we check? Is it possible to check? Possible to check. Check the speed, yeah. Because yeah. I, ha I, um, I have... I ask first to the... Uh, yeah, you can ask. Can we check the speed? It's important for me. Yeah. See the many smiley faces. We also are working. And also here some kind of activities. And well that's it. See smiley faces. Smiley people. It's good. 
so the spirit of co-working is here it's good and then um, the rules is such uh, Monday to Friday you have your uh, your table with will connection with internet connection and it's gonna cost you 250 per day speed is more than 100 120 around upload download and uh, you can leave you can leave your laptop uh, while you're working here if you rent for the five days you can leave it for five days on the, on the place so you don't uh, carry with you the stuff which is good i guess and then of course the beautiful view here Well, that's Louisa Mall and uh, Source Away co working space. That's a nice place for the, for the picnic. See over there, small promenade. In the middle of the city, you have a small resort. You can go out, sit down, chill down, eat your fruits. Galeria Luisa, sorry, not the mall, Galeria, yeah. Like uh, YouTube, mainly, always. Then we have a games. Crossfire, crossfire. Hello. Gaming, hello. YouTube, um, why do I see the news? news. One is email, YouTube, uh, YouTube, uh, YouTube, uh, maybe YouTube, 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 Facebook, Facebook, YouTube, YouTube, gaming, gaming. Well, that's a reality. So, majority of the people now are uh, consuming the videos. Huge amount of the video stream. Well. per hour one more solution one more option well you see you have options here you need just to find them
the underwater fisherman well it's interesting what they get there it's one of the most popular promenades here in Tangbilaran city as you see the old people like to have a walk along the sea and unfortunately in Asia it's not the kind of uh, popular thing to have a promenade along the sea. If you're gonna go in the Mediterranean, you're gonna always see like promenade along the sea in the town, the restaurants and just the walking streets. And here is kind of more industrialized. So I remember when I faced, first time came to Asia, I was wondering why there is no uh, typical European promenade along the sea. And it is. There is no promenade typically. It's Sheldon. So yeah, and uh, this is uh, artificially made for people to have uh, opportunity to go along along the sea and walk in beautiful environment. So you take the pictures.
Well, karaoke sometimes is not in the best quality here. Oh, well, that's for sure. <laughs> yeah. Well, that could be annoying. But I guess uh, local people are used to that, so they don't take it so close to the heart. It's not even uh, possible, I guess, like this uh, in Europe somewhere. In public place, karaoke, uh, with uh, not the best way uh, to interact with people, entertain people. So, because not necessarily everybody will like the song or uh, singer. company advertisement piso wi-fi <laughs> so i guess the local guys they provide different kind of services here and uh, funny kids yeah As you see the Wi-Fi network, CCTV, internet solutions, <laughs> and entertainment for the kids, of course. around and spend the evenings. <laughs> <laughs> 